Hey Zesties, I'm Michelle Boyle and welcome or welcome back to my channel Zesty Girl. Today I've got a Kmart haul, so I am looking at so many different things today in store. Here's a little sneak preview for you. Look at all the things that I'm going to have a look at today. I had so much fun at Kmart today looking through all the things. So if this is the type of video for you, if you want to shop with me, then let's do this. Okay, so Kmart, let's go. And today I'm looking for some face cloths and a bedside table lamp for Jessica. So I'm not gonna to spend too much time in this area because we did it the other day. And if you haven't seen that video, I'll link it above. But I do notice a couple of things. First off is this large clear turntable. It's huge. I haven't seen it before. So luckily one of them's out of the box. So look how amazing that is. If you've got a deep pantry, that would be so great for maximizing the space. Okay, so moving on, I saw some rubbish bins. I'm always looking out for rubbish bins. And I got really close to buying the five liter one for the one of the children's room just to try it. But then I sort of imagined every one of the children's room having a, a rubbish bin and having to empty it. So I went, nah, not today. This looked amazing, $10 for this to hold the pot lids. So I'm quite interested in that product. I'll have a think about that. $19 for the shelf to go over the microwave. I thought that was really clever as a storage solution. Looking along here, there's nothing I need here. Oh, actually I was looking at some pegs because I do need some pegs. And then I came across this. I think it's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. It's gorgeous, laundry hamper on wheels. I was having a look at these, but there's a couple of ladies here having a good look. So I didn't quite spend as much time there as I wanted to. This looked amazing. It's got dividers in it that you can use different ways. And it's a turntable, so great for in the bathroom cupboards to put your hair dryer and your brushes and that type of thing in. And then I'm looking at face cloths. I'm trying, I was, my idea was to get different colored ones for each of the children to, for their bathroom. And then I thought, no, a better solution, well, this one's for me, but it'd be, see, I was getting the different colors. But then I thought a better solution is that they just use one and then they put it in the bath and I can collect it for washing so that we don't reuse them, that we just sort of like, and you just use all the same color. The thought of all the different colors in the bathroom, I just went, uh, no. And I got that uh, thing matte for around the toilet, so I'm gonna try that. Looking for lamps here for Jessica, I chose this one, this $12 lamp. So I'm just gonna give that a go and see if it's nice. I just love the price, I thought $12. How could I go wrong with $12? So we'll see what it looks like, I'll, I'll share that with you later. Diamond Globe, these sit into these bases and it was only $6, but that was a candle, it wasn't a base and I couldn't find the bases. This was $2.50, this thing, like it's an ornament thing. So even though it's clearance $2, I just, I no, I was like, I don't know what you do with that. This was on sale for, what was it? It wasn't $16, $5. And I'm like, I want it because it was all boxed, but I had no purpose for it, so I didn't get it. Okay, fan heater, $27. We have one, we love it. Highly recommend it. Incense, I don't need it at the moment. I've still got a packet. These were amazing, $10 each, and they were so lovely to touch. Moss green, natural, and brown. Love them, $10 each. These were a bit more expensive at $18. All these neutral colors, they're amazing. They were large, they were fluffy, they were gorgeous to touch because I did touch them, because I always touch everything. Okay, $59 for this heater. I think that's a great price. And this was on clearance, and I thought it was gorgeous. How much is it? $69, I think. Yeah, $69. Amazing. I would have loved that. Now, I just had a little touch of this just to see if it's good. It was beautiful. And these were on clearance as well, $20 each. for sort of a, And they sort of felt like feathers, so it was sort of a weird feeling. This I thought would be amazing on the boys' new duvet covers. If you haven't seen, have you seen the boys' duvet covers? I think I made a short of me putting those on the bed. I thought they'd look nice at the end of the bed. And these are towels, not tea towels. They're actually towels sets. They're just a bit messy. But see, they're quite nice, quite different. And then I didn't go around the long way. I, I ducked through the alleyway into the clothing section because I really wanted to look at some clothes today. So these are sweatshirts, different types of sweatshirts, all reasonably priced, $22 for this gray New York one. Really nice fabric. There's Detroit there. And what else? $20 for this one. Oh, I really like these. These sort of, um, oh, what do you call it? Stone, not stone wash, acid wash sort of look sweatshirts. And then I moved into the knitwear. I've seen these a few times in the last month. 
and some of them on sale. $28 for that one. They're not on sale. Why did I even say that? Oh, yes, this one was on sale. I was going to get this. I just thought $12. It's just so versatile. But I'm stop I stopped myself because I don't need it. I've got things like that. I don't need it. Okay, so this knitwear is so well priced. And look at the colors of this one. $15. It's just a very plain knit top. But the colors are really nice, the blue and the fawn and everything. But I love how this model's dress, look at this. I could never put an outfit together like this. Those big chunky jackets and the little cross body bag and this. Look at this dress. Look at that model. Wow. Here I am back at the same top, my boring old tops that I love. The round neck, long sleeve, $20. I was going to try them on today, but then I was just having fun looking and I couldn't be bothered. So I will do that next time maybe. This skirt, what I'm looking for is I'm looking for a long denim skirt with a split up the front, not up the back. So, yes, that's what I'm looking for. I just thought this lady up in the photograph looked so gorgeous with her red hair and that purple. It was gorgeous. And I was looking for that top. Now, I was this one, I don't think I've got. I don't think I've got this color in the V-neck. I think I've got every color but that one. So I was just going to take a good photo of it so I could check at home whether I had it. That Harvard t-shirt in the cobalt blue was really lovely, but I don't like wearing that much label. And these, I'm looking for long sleeve winter tops just to check out what colors they had because I always like to have them in, in on hand. This color, the gray mail, which I just don't like gray mail. And that was better. And this chocolate brown. So I was a bit like, hmm. I thought they might have some bright colors, but no. I just wanted some of those cheap long sleeve tops that you can wear under things. So that was about it. Now, unless I'm missing a section. But I feel that there should be more and there should be better colors. But anyway, so I decided to have a look at bags because I love those crossbody bags. And but I couldn't find what I was looking for. Scarves, I'm never gonna wear. I just don't think I'm gonna wear a scarf. I just think that's for other people. I love them, but I'm just not a scarf wearer. These were really nice. I was looking for the price, and then I saw it. The price of these is around ten dollars, so I thought that was a good price. And these were on a display up the front, twelve dollars for these ones. I thought they were very like autumn, very autumn sort of colors, which was great. I'm looking for some soft um, microfiber face cloths to get my makeup off at night, and so I did see some, but I did not what I'm looking for. And Epsom bath salts. I need some might have gone really weird so I just want to get some new ones and I fell in love with this avocado bath fizzer I didn't buy it because I don't need it but yes I didn't I didn't buy it I was a good girl okay so Epsom salts yes this was a good range actually five dollars for that huge huge container I had a quick look at Easter eggs just to see the pricing I just think they're so expensive for what they are seven dollars fifty I'm hoping to pick up some on sale that's what I'm hoping in a couple of days, but who knows. Now, I tried this fragrance because it was open. It was a tester, $8, and yes, it was really, 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 really nice. Uh, this was on sale for $3.50, and I really want a big clip like that, but the color was so bad, I just couldn't buy it. And finally, I really love this bag. I really loved it, but I didn't get it today. Okay, so that's it. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. I'd love to have you here. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video. See ya. Bye.